Hey guys, this is Tyler Disney. I am the BIM guy over at Integral Group Oakland. Um, and in this video, I'm going to be talking about why David Rushforth kicks so much ass. Um, specifically, I'm going to be talking about how you can use the plugin Rushforth Tools to swap the scheduled shared parameters between uh, one family and another family. So we do all of our equipment scheduling in Revit using shared parameters and we have a large library of basic boxes for separate pieces of equipment that are preloaded with shared parameters such as this guy shared parameters that talk to our pre-made template equipment schedules such as this guy now this guy is a really big schedule it's like our full master HU schedule so there's a lot of uh, fields to it and so what we often do is we use this basic box through SD and DD when we're still tweaking the design and then once we have a final selection for what we want we'll go to the manufacturer and we'll get their detailed um, family that is looks good and it's detailed and impresses the client and all that The problem is that family doesn't have shared parameters. So let's walk through this exercise and show how Rustforth Tools makes this brain dead easy. So here we go, we've got our uh, AHU, it's basic, we want to swap it out with another one. I've downloaded this guy from the internets or from my rep, I drop it in to my project, stick it there, that looks lovely going to change the type mark of it so that it filters into my schedule type mark H U will say and so great there it is it's showing up I want it to be H U 2 um, but all of these fields are not editable and that's because this family does not have my shared parameters in it so normally if you didn't have any plugins, your method would be to hit edit family, click this button, click add, find your shared parameters file, select it, dig through, H, U, and fan, find one, hit OK, hit OK, now it's in, OK, do it again, 50 goddamn times or whatever. So that's awful, so we don't do that anymore. With Rushforth Tools, you have two options. One, you could just click on this guy, go to Rushforth Tools, click Parameter Scheduler. And you could just click Shared Parameters File, and you could go through, and you could say, OK, I need that guy. OK, I know I need that guy. OK, I, need, I know I need these. You could throw those in there. You could say, OK, I, need, I know I need these need group quote unquote need all these guys throw them there and then you could pretty quickly populate your family with the shared parameters you need uh, by clicking add to selected elements down there but there's an even quicker way if you already have a family that already has the exact shared parameters you need so what we do is instead of clicking on this guy we click on the schedule and we click RF tools we click parameter scheduler and it's going to automatically detect which parameters are both in this family and in the schedule that this family does not have. Populate this list with them and just give me this one little button here. I can click, I wait a little bit. This is a pretty big family, so it might take just a few seconds. Um, bam, I'm done. I've got all the parameters I need. And now you might say, hey Tyler, that's really cool, except it didn't take all of the uh, values. So for example, uh, you know, these were the values of all the shared parameters of my original one, and what I'm wanting to do is swap. So I actually want all of these values in here. Again, you could just you know, copy and paste or whatever. That's kind of a pain in the ass. Uh, so just click on that guy swap it down to that guy which now has all the parameters in it uh, and it retains all of the data 
So yeah, swapping from a uh, generic geometry file to a custom HU, getting it fully scheduled, took me about 30 seconds of real time if I wasn't chatting at you guys. That's awesome. Full disclosure, I don't get any money from David. This is, he's not hooking me up. It's just that friggin' awesome. Um, if you do scheduling of equipment in Revit and you don't have this tool, I don't know what you're doing with your life. Thanks, that's it.